and Tate Thompson leading that trio so potent when they are on. And the Sabres need them here, and we are underway. Flyers and the Sabres. 50 seconds gone into the man advantage, and getting another group of fours onto the ice. Noah Cates is one of those fours. He plays it back to the line. Far circle shot. Lucan in the save. The rebound. High slot. Chance. Lucan in pushing out with traffic in front to make the stop. Speed will work for Paterk as he gains the line. But a good stick check as he got there. And Ryan Paling for the Flyers. And a long shoot into Lucan. And he'll glove that one. And he'll hold on with company coming very quickly to the front of the net. Relief appearance, his first NHL appearance against the Islanders. Yeah, you think it'd be in his first game here, a little nervous. You'd want to get some pucks to him. Sabres have yet to been able to get a shot. Here's Dalin testing him, and Fedotov kind of top line matchup again. Frost connecting and Forster. That puck sort of the net. Lucan had just got a piece of it on the back end. Sandheim. Yeah, they've been outscored 23 to 10 in those five games too. Only collecting two loser points along the way. Potential two on one here on the counter by the Flyers. Sabres trying to get back to help out. They will not, and it's Lukanen who saves the day with a good stop. Extremely hard. They're doing their part here, keeping it into the Flyers' home, but then bump back to the line. Power pressured by Tyson Forster. Now Alex Tuck with a nice move to regain the offensive zone. Tate Thompson wants this goal. And the Sabres take the lead with 9.59 remaining in the opening period. It's 1-0. That's going to tie Paterka for the team lead in goals. But this is what this line can do right here. You see how aggressive the goaltender comes way out right there. And that's all that Cage needs is that little extra time. He's probably three feet from that post, not able to cut it off. Cage pretends he's going to the middle, gives a little head fake, comes back across. Buffalo with the lead, 10-0-1 into the hockey game. Alex Tuck, what a play off the wall, back to himself, to the line. Dolin slap pass to the border. Thompson turns and fires that one quickly, trying to catch Fedotov off the post. Thompson again this time over on the far side of the ice for Dolin. Fans on up a right to power near circle. Dolin lost it at the line. Power comes back to help, and he's going to have to keep coming back here. It's a Flyers counter with a three on two. Drop pass saved by Lukanen. Overplaying on one side, if you can get that puck going across the puck, top of the blue paint, it's going to lead to plenty of opportunities for you. Flyers work it back to the line, change of direction, stopped by Lukanen. His fan on the shot, Sabres just play it to the wall, not out, and the Flyers keep it in the zone. Up back to the line, stall shot, stopped by Lukanen. It's right in front of the net, play to the corner again, but right back to. Konechny, Konechny trying to set it in front of the net. Up from behind the net, it'll be spun to the near point. That was a slap pass intended to the far post, didn't get there. Farabee and Atkinson on the ice for the Flyers. Now right in front, Lukanen with a big stop. Sandheim down on the far corner, plays it down to the goal line. Sealer up top, Konechny to the far circle, got it back again, big save by Lukanen. Rebound! Out to center, Brake quickly trying to turn the play into the Buffalo zone. Seven seconds to go in the period. Flyers gain the line. And Lukanen will hold this one with. For the next minute, 45 is the way we go. Sabres will attack from right to left in this frame. Flyers in their own whites. Crowd in behind the Sabres goal as the Flyers with Paling in front of the net. Now he'll pull out with that shot. Luke in first save. Rebound to get there as well. Oh, that is a big one. Yeah, it looks like it's going to get the opportunity right here. He's on one in front. Two jabs at it. But see how quick Lukanen gets across and how aggressive. He doesn't stay in the blue paint. Watch. Once he comes across, he realizes he's out. And he's right outside the blue paint and makes that one. But he does a nice job just shuffling him across, pushing with that right leg, getting himself over. Making himself as big as possible. And Buffalo will not be able to clear again as again Victor Olofsson didn't get that puck up and out of the zone right in front. Oh, what a brilliant save by Lucan and right in front of the goal. He's going to have to do it again. Here comes Case. Scores. 
Atkinson in front was stopped by a brilliant save made by Uko Pekalukkanen. But it's Cates that gets the goal. And we're tied at one. Had a couple yeah. opportunities to get it out. They could not get it out over the zone. And then eventually Cates is going to be the guy who takes the shot coming down the offside. And he's going to get his fifth goal of the year. Look at how everything is wide open. Everything's on your left side of your screen. The only one coming across is Byram to try to contest them a little bit because they got running around. They all got flooded over to the far side of the ice. Flyers get it out to center. Into the Buffalo zone. So speaking of fast, it's off the post that time. One of those two shooters. Paley here puts it off the post. The Flyers just flip it up and into the corner. Well, it's easy to say for me up here, but here's Alex Tuck. Middle of the ice. Stays with it. Drops it. Tucks in. Paterka! That almost snuck under the pad. He'll get to center. Dahlin in the flyer zone drops it one more time Thompson holds fires glove side high that'll go to the corner Dahlin to Thompson Back to Dahlin middle lane is there fire scores Shot on net here tonight for the Sabres you just see they give them that whole middle lane nobody comes out and attacks them and they just allow him to take the shot. Sandheim looks like the guy in the, oh, York, I'm sorry, in the middle of the ice. He backs off. Nobody addresses him. And he just able to get locked and loaded just about the top of the circles and puts it right over the blocker shoulder. Around to the corner. The Flyers give it right back towards Dolene. His outlet is on power. Ten seconds to go in the period. Good pass to Benson. He's in the Flyers zone. In the slot. Scores! Oh, what a read. And the finish from Quinn puts Buffalo up 3-1 to one with 5.1 seconds to go in the second period. But look at this work down low here. Nice job by Darlene. Power finds Benson wide open at the far blue line where he always is. But when Benson gets it, look, he's looking the whole time. And he just gets himself in that area. We can make that little pass across. He knows he can't get to the net there. And he's got a streak in Jack Quinn coming right down the gut of the ice from the top of the circles once again. 99th career game played tonight for that man. Number 22, Jack Quinn. Picking up his sixth goal of the season. Jurgensen's and Robinson out with Victor Olofsson. The Flyers will bring it out. Pass though in behind off escape. Gergensen's for Robinson! And just a piece by Fedotov. In behind the net for Power. Can't clear. Flyers long shot scores! Traffic in front with the shot from the point by Tippett. Have to see if it hits something on the way in. I think it just hit Lukanen actually. Uh, let's take a look at here's the shot. Oh, I think what it might go off is maybe Skinner when the shot is taken. Let's see if it deflects off him. Yeah, it does. And look, it just changes the direction of that shot just a little bit. And Lukanen thinks he's got it right to where the glove is. And you see he just up and down the bench, letting him know what needs to happen here and what's not happening. Sabres get back on side. Good puck protection by Benson as they look for Dylan Cousins. Scores! Puck didn't need to get to Dylan Cousins as Quinn's got another one. Gonna get his seventh and maybe the little message Donnie Granado sent during that last team timeout got to the guys and here's Benson once again. Just so good at just distributing the puck. He realized he's under siege right there. He's got Quinn coming with some speed down the side. The initial shot saved. And then it lays there and he's able to pick up the rebound. Now they get it outside the line with seven seconds to go. Rangers are helping out, leading the Red Wings. Capitals and Hurricanes are tied at two. The Sabres took care of business here tonight, winning it four to two.